The following video contains profanity and language that some viewers may find offensive. Viewer discretion is advised. Welcome to Fright. What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Sister Girl on Films. And y'all, we are back with another episode of Fright Night. <laughs> so as you can tell by the title, we will be watching a Christmas horror film. Now y'all, I'm gonna be transparent and honest, okay? Because y'all my peoples. So prior to this, I was watching Santa's Slay, which stars Goldberg, the wrestler from back in the day. And I was about halfway through the film in my reaction and I was so bored. And it was just not giving anything. And I was like, y'all, let me just delete delete that shit, Peggy. Let me delete the footage. Delete all that shit! Let's play with you, Peggy! Let me start over. So, y'all, it's pretty late. Because <laughs> I started watching one movie, doing one reaction, and then just was not feeling it. And I'm not going to give y'all just a bullshit movie just for bullshit's sake. So, we're going to start all over, and we're going to watch Better Watch Out. Um, I've heard that this was a pretty good um, Christmas themed horror film, so I'm pretty excited about it. I've never seen it before, so I don't know what to expect. I just heard good things about it and I googled Christmas horror films and there were some that I'd seen, quite a few that I hadn't. So we are going to check this one out to start off our holiday season. So you already know what to do, get yourself something to drink, get yourself something to snack on, and let's go ahead and get into You Better Watch Out, You Better Not Cry. I said that wrong. Okay, let's get the movie started. <laughs> the learners asked me to babysit. Hey, Ricky, why would you, why? <laughs> mm-hmm, that's why you stay off that phone, young lady, while you're driving. Hi, Mom, no, 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 everything's fine. It's just traffic. Mom, look, I gotta go. Hey, I love you. Okay, here we go. Damn, I'm on a streak. Want to put her in the mood? Watch your horror movie. When we're scared, our brains pump out dopamine. Same chemical we release when we're aroused. So fear really makes girls wet. Told you. Bam! Oh, look who uh, decided to come out of his room. Don't I remember something about the trash getting taken out? And don't forget the shovel. Mm. So what's your problem, Louie? Weirdo. Go on, Luke, and then we can hang out. Yeah, come on. Grab the garbage and all the likes the, the uh, most recycling. weird shit online. Okay, I want to show you this. Hmm? We're going to do things a little bit differently. Lucas has been sleepwalking again. Oh, no. Oh, just a minute. Garrett, what are you doing in here? Oh. <laughs> uh, do, you have, do you have any itch cream? My shoulder really is. Top shelf. Ricky, no, that was a joke. No. What the hell was that? Luke! What? There's a spider, kill it. Just kill it, squish it. Girl, why can't you kill the damn spider? That's a big ass spider. You didn't do anything wrong. Right. <sighs> what? I can handle myself just fine, thank you. The answer's still no. Big ass spider, where the hell y'all live? There you go, big guy. Ricky, I know. Aw, I need a good little you. boy scout. <laughs> Chill, what's all that? I'm not doing it. Hold on. <laughs> Laundry. Baby, I'm here to sit the babies, okay? Not to do the laundry. Unless you pay me extra. <laughs> I don't know, something Luke, up with this little Luke kid. Look at that damn picture. Like a little killer. Luke? Lucas, what are you doing? Oh, you what? No, you are way too young to be drinking. Give me that. Oh, this? Yes, that. Give it to me. Ugh. Lucas, Boo. And F them kids. Okay. He don't even listen to his mama. He definitely ain't gonna listen to you, girl. 
disrespectful little shit. Girl, that door was definitely shut. Oh, what's happening? Well, there was a car that was following her earlier. Is this what this is going to be like? An intruder type car? Bust. Me? What about you, mister? Well, I'm going to tell if you don't. Girl, do. don't you fall for that. <sighs> Jeez Louise. Girl, I'm sorry, but I have never, was never the teen that was like, hey, kid that's underage, drink alcohol. No. This is a little shit. 12, 13. Plus you're drunk, kiddo. I am not drunk, and I am not a kiddo. You're 12. 13 in a few weeks. Thank you for answering that. Okay, and more information. If I were your age, I'd date you. Really? Girl, you just shit. I forgot to order the pizza. Don't say things like that to little kids. It's just weird. God, Luke, you didn't tell me you ordered something. I didn't. Now you let me know. I'll be back in one second, okay? If you were a babysitter, and this little shithead was running out here drinking alcohol, all up in your business, okay. putting his hand on your thigh. Would you be okay with him just like all yeah, up under you know, and we'll all this weird shit? Hey, or would I'm you be like, you, you okay, know, I don't know what's happening, you. but let me just, Maybe. Maybe. there's no chance. Okay. Like you are too young for me. I have a boyfriend. Hey. If I didn't have a boyfriend, you're still too you young for me. Buddy. You know that, right? Then just watch the movie. Hey, and you just, like, why are you sitting up under him? Bobby. Why would Who's in the background? Am I tripping? Oh, hell no. Nah. What is happening? Girl. Call the police. Luke, get my phone. Oh, oh God damn it, Luke. Sorry. Oh, God damn it, you guys that coffee? I didn't mean to. Oh, Luke. What? I, I'm not scared. Well, we don't know who it is. And look. No one's there. What the hell? Look, no, don't You wait. little Luke. shit. Whoever's out there, cut it out. I, I know Taekwondo. Taekwondo your ass in this house and close the damn door. Hi. How are you? Get off me! <laughs> Dude, you guys faces. Your faces, you were like, hey! You asshole! Stay here. What in the hell is going on? Oh. Yeah, yeah, don't. 911, I'm going up there. If I scream, press send and hide. Got it? Okay. Or, or, hear me out. Just call them and hit send now. Balls. And tell them to bring the ass. Because obviously something ain't right. We'll just take my car, we'll grab it, and we'll run. What is it? Stay back. Get against the door. What? The is this is the pizza man? Did you hear that? What is happening? Get upstairs. It's that car that was following them. Girl, close that mother freaking door. What happened to Garish? I hate this little boy. I just want to say that right now. Child. Why is it always the babysitters? Child, it's more than one? Oh, 
What y'all gonna do? Yeah, I'm stressed out. Like, who are these people? And why they want you? I'm scared too. But I have to get the gun. Wait, no. This little boy is acting very strange, okay? Maybe just because he wants to try to impress her. But he's a little weirdo. Yeah. Luke, stay here. Don't worry, I'll protect you. Luke, going out there is not a brave way. It's stupid. Luke, try to let him go out there so he can get shot. You little girl. You have a gun. You have a gun. Oh my god. Oh my god. Garrett? I know you lying. Yeah. I know you are lying. Take that mask off. I know uh, you are lying. Bitch. joke i we were gonna scare you yeah well you did you scared the shit out of me why 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 would you do that are you Thank shitting you me dipshit here. all it is your friend is holding a real gun this is serious how could you do that because you treat me like a child and what you were gonna show me how much of a man you were by rescuing me from fake armed robbers you are a child i almost broke my neck you're a selfish brat with no consideration you need therapy lots of it Okay, girl, let's be clear. Obviously, he's crazy. Maybe uh, don't I'm say all that. Are your dad's hunting stuff? Ashley, what? <gasps> what did you just do? What the fuck? What the fuck did you just do? I knew something was wrong with this little boy. The math was not mathing for me. Oh, hell. Y'all, what is this? Okay, this took a turn. I'm thinking we're about to watch an invasion film. Fuck Mary with the adventure time change. The scares weren't really giving me the scares, so I'm like, but we got to warm up to it. It's still early on. It's just it's something totally different. Sure you know what you're doing? Always. Slow. There. All better. How does the boy is a straight up psychopath? It's up. Come on, it's hilarious. What do you think, Ashley? Oh, thank you, Luke. I've literally never looked better. <laughs> this is kind of terrifying. Oh, this kid. Oh, this movie is big time. F them kids. Luke, listen to me, okay? Uh, 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 I didn't say talk. You talk when I tell you. This is so oddly disturbing. Um, okay. Like, talk. kids. Luke, listen to me, okay? I being in control of any situation. I need to go to the hospital. Put the gun down and untie me. Terrifying. This needs to stop immediately. I look, truth or dare? Oh, yeah, it would be dare, of course. Oh okay. my god. Um, I dare you to touch your dick. This dick. is terrifying. No, please don't. And I know it doesn't it's seem like it, but. Rules, Ashley. Have you been around 12 year old boys? 
oh, if they are unsupervised, in control, like they are just, how humiliating. I can't. I really hope these children, nice, huh? <laughs> and I thought I would never I say this. Like a little boy just felt me up. Have the worst little deaths they could Actually. possibly have. Luke, truth or dare? Why is anybody asking me? <laughs> I dare you to take your little ass home. Did you ever tell Garrett that you killed his hamster? What? The answer is no next turn. You said LeBron escaped out of the hole in my screen. Not LeBron. <laughs> yeah, you just said first. What the fuck, man? Look, I, I, I don't like this, man. So now it went too far when you found out your little ugly hamster got killed. But now when he slapped her, knocked her out down the stairs, sexually assaulted her. Stop, what are you uh, okay. I'm done. Bite his hand. <laughs> Ricky? Yeah, man. Open. The boyfriend. No. We already know he's gonna die. I know she's in there. She texted me to come over like half an hour ago. She doesn't want to see you. I just want to talk to her. Go away. She doesn't love you anymore. She told me. Little oh boy, that is the most fake movie weirdo shit you can do. She said she didn't love you. Little oh boy, open this damn door. I them through the door. Right. Kick it open. Thanks, man. I'm laughing, but I know boyfriend's going to die. What the hell are you doing? Cut his ass. These camera shots are pretty good. I ain't going to lie to you. Give me a light. What are you going in there to get? Oh, Jesus. This little... There you go. He's fucking 12. Like, the day I will allow a 12 year old to. Where is she? Don't beat his brain. Okay, but no, but maybe do. Drop it. Drop it. I'm serious. I'll blow your fucking face off in three. Two. All right, all right, all right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, don't shoot me. Uh, okay, 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 get on your knees. Please. Okay, okay. Hush. And then look. <gasps> oh my God. What the fuck? Holy shit. What do we do now? This is exciting. This little boy is really certifiable. We're going to fucking jail. Luke, we're going to fucking die in prison. No, we're not. This is his little smug little self. I hate everything about him. <laughs> Fuck. Where are you taking him? These kids are. <laughs> what is this little dickhead about to do now? We're going to see who's right once and for all. Mythbuster style. He is not about to hit him in the face with a paint can. I know you are lying to my face. I have no idea. What the fuck, man? Oh, you're in a fucking home alone again? Dude, what are you doing, man? Please let me out of this. It's level with his head. What the fuck are you doing, dude? You're gonna kill him. I said put it down! Okay. I know you are. Please don't show it. Please don't show it. Please don't show it. God! Holy shit, his head! His head had just exploded! I told you, Garrett! I told you! Why are you laughing? I said, why are you laughing? Because you can't shoot me, Ash. Don't come any closer, I mean it. So ain't no damn bullets in that gun. Responsible paranoia keeps the ammo separate. Get 
her, get her! If this little boy gets away with this shit, I'm going to be so pissed off. Like, so pissed off. Chad, I feel like this is how Patrick Bateman started. <laughs> if you've seen American Psycho, you know who that is. This was his origin story. Fucking psychopath. His damn parents been out. This is it. Been, this been happening for a long time. <laughs> You're dumb. You are really dumb. Dumb. <laughs> you are really dumb. <laughs> Sorry. You really think that she will send that boy out there to do all that? And she was your girlfriend. You should know better than that. Fucking cat. Hey, kid, where'd you go? <gasps> o M G. -a. These boys did nothing to deserve this. None of these kids, because you're so crazy that you are killing people for nothing. Let me just say. In terms of writing, this is very good. Because a lot of times in horror films, like the victims are a lot of times just unbearable. And while he wasn't like, he seemed like he may have kind of been a jerk, he didn't deserve this. We didn't even know nothing about him. Other guy was really actually kind of sweet. Wow. And Ashley, obviously, to do, I mean, she was dumb. Allowing him to drink and shit and not having no boundaries. But that don't deserve all of this at all. I just wish I had the balls to step up. <gasps> I told you not to touch her, you asshole! I know you are lying to my face. You shot me. Look what you made me do. I'm dying. Why did you make me do it? Why did you make me do it? First of all, this little boy's acting Help. is very Help. good. Help. Shut up! I want my mom. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! If his little ass don't die or get arrested at the end of this movie, I am writing a letter to my congressman. <laughs> Unacceptable. Anyway. This, he is the worst. Never gonna let me go He's worse than a little heifer in the orphan. What's her name? Guilty. I can't remember. Esther. He worse than Esther, child. He worse than Malachi and Children of the Corn. Get your ass off me. You worse than that damn I'm Annabelle there. doll. My mom used to tuck me in. Boy, I don't give a fuck about you, your mama, your daddy, nothing. Where the fuck you get a knife from? Oh my god. I hate this little boy so much. If she die. And he get away with all this shit. <laughs> the way I am going to write a letter. Do y'all hear me? I cannot. This movie is dark and sick. I would have preferred an invasion intruder type situation. Look at this little bitch. Told you y'all, Patrick Bateman. 
the preteen years. This was the prequel to American Psycho. I can't. If this little boy get away with this, I am going to write a Yelp review <laughs> to somebody, to the makers of this film, because I know you're aligned to my face. Shout out to the fact that this movie is set in Illinois, just like Home Alone and all the Home Alone references. And also the whole babysitter motif and Halloween was also set in Illinois. I see you, I see you, I see you. But this little bitch better not get away with this or I'm not gonna see you. You're gonna see me in court. <laughs> Cause I'm suing you. Y'all, this little bitch better not get away with this. How much time we got left in this movie? Y'all, it is not that much time left. He gonna get away with this? Yes! Which one? Ashley, please be alive, Ashley. Vitals are holding. What do we got? Stab wound to the neck. Oh, Ashley, yes. Smart girl. Saved your life. Yeah, you little bitch. No, he needs to die, though. I don't like this. Yes, I'm happy Ashley survived, but no, he needs to die. He has caused so much mayhem and torture. He killed his best friend. He killed those two boys for nothing. He sexually assaulted her, tried to kill her, and he just gets to just Go to a psych ward? Because I'm sure that's what's going to happen. No, he needs to get. All right, y'all. So that was Better Watch Out. I, I didn't know what to expect. <laughs> I did not know what to expect. I did not know this was a Patrick Bateman origin story. Because this little boy. Uh, I just don't even know how to feel, okay? Okay. Number one, I'm glad Ashley survived. Great. But now what? I wanted that little boy to die. <laughs> he was awful. He's probably one of the worst kids I have ever seen in any horror film. If I have to rank him, Luke's bitch ass, I don't know his last name, but his, his name is now Luke's bitch ass, is number one on my list. I just, that whole ordeal in the beginning, like there's an intruder coming in the house. I was in on it, but I was also like, this boy is acting really weird, but also he has a crush on her, but also what is happening? But I like the movie. It was a, it was a good time. I, it was a good time. The performances were really good. It was a creative take on the whole babysitter slasher film situation you know <laughs> um like i said in the during the movie shout out to i don't know who wrote and directed this but shout out to them for having this set in illinois having it reference um home alone having it have the babysitter thing just like halloween like i'm sure there's some other illinois references but those are two classic films set in illinois around major holidays one particular home alone with christmas and i just really appreciated those references so i'm still mad about the ending <laughs> i'm so
so mad. I'm glad Ashley lived though. Cause if Ashley, bitch, let me tell you something. If Ashley had died and the last scene on this movie would have been him looking out that window and her going to the corner because she was in a body bag. Oh, bitch. Tomato, 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 tomato. I would have been so pissed off. So shout out to the director and the writer for giving us the ending that was kind of satisfying. Not completely because I wanted Luke dead. But I don't know, y'all. I don't have hope that Luke would have. I mean, yeah, he killed like four people. Three? Two. Three people. I just cannot. This movie was crazy. <laughs> I hate Luke so much. I hate this little boy. So let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you've ever seen Better Watch Out, <sighs> what you thought about it, how you felt about the ending. I am still pissed off and I wanted retribution. I guess we're not going to get it. So let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And as always, y'all like this video, share this video, subscribe to my channel. And I'm going to see y'all next time for another episode of Fright Night Friday. Good night, y'all.